Hey, what's up everybody? Sewer Badger here with more Leagues of Liberty. At this point, it's so stuck in my brain, I accidentally say it whenever I'm trying to explain Wings of Liberty to uh, someone else. It's uh, just the Leagues of Liberty. Uh, but unfortunately, before we can go to Agria, um, before we can jump into the juice, we have some buying to do. And, uh, as it stands, our pair is massive. Can place... Well, what? Nobody expects a pairing inquisition. Big pair man gets the ability to merge into the big pair man. Has double shields. Can hit air units. Gains massive damage against massive units. They lose bonus damage against armored units. <laughs> I think I bought both of these. No, I only bought one of them. Um. Uh. <laughs> I know feeding hungry Zerks was a bad idea, but look how happy they are now, and they only ate a bit of the soup. Oh my god. Alright, so what do we want here? Uh, next mission is Agria. I don't think we're really going to meet a whole lot of massive units there. Um, Maffle tech. We have the technology. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. So, Demic? I am become Demic, destroyer of zealots. Zaseli Vale. So what do we want? I want I want Archon pairs. And uh let's go for reinforced frame. Let's hop into the laboratory, let's check it out, bro. Alright, reinforced cumber. Increases Cumber Shield by 100 and adds plus or one shield armor. Increase Cumber healing rate by 33%. Why are you not better, I ask the shield, and this is the result. Can you feel the sunshine? Does it brighten up your day? Don't you feel like you can kill a guy again? Um, okay, I'll go for Moss Healing. Moss Healing! I'm gonna go for a field experience. And, uh. Biogenetics versus mercenary pandas and mini filtering versus econo economized VCS. Alright, so let's go back to the bridge. Oh, let's actually visit the cantina real quick. Because, my god, this is taking a bit. If you will, uh, want to just skip ahead, this is... Oh, no, yep. Never mind. Let's go right to the bridge. Let's get into it. Come on, come on, come on, load up. Ah! We're going to go ahead and skip talking to Tosh. Because... He's not our bro anymore. He sent us to Lava World. Let's go ahead and skip this cutscene because we've already spent enough time on this. Let's hop right into the action. As we hop into the evacuation, Agri as we rescue the world's second most useless character, Ariel Hansen. It's only second most because she actually gives you her research at the end of it. The most useless has got to be Kaczynski. Look at him go. So, um... Let's look at this. Maffle area. This unit's attacks leave fire on the ground, dealing damage to enemy units. Field experience? It's produced... Okay, so this... Regens. So let's... Hop right along and get into the, uh...
Hmm. I wonder if he just... Let's go ahead and give this area a good searching. I wonder if he just hands it to you because he just doesn't want, or just, just doesn't want people to hunt for it or for it. Let's go ahead and run towards it. I mean, I'm gonna be honest. And say that uh, Hanson is worse at macro than I am. Pretty much saying something. Pretty much. Not quite fully saying something, but uh, we're gonna check out that pair. Uh, the big pair, man. Let's go ahead and dance this baby. Oh. oh, it did dance, it just didn't have an animation. No. Alright, so these have s place stem bod. Plays shield bot. What are these? Th are they? They're basilisks. Oh, rip. Wait, two of them? So, they come out in pairs, yep. They're cumbers, Jimmy. They're cumbers. Which really just doesn't sound right, regardless of how you, uh... Alright, so... So, um, this, ha this has been, uh, happening. Let's go ahead and, uh... So, some more Zerg research. Okay, so I got more basilisks. The Ling of Wiberty. So let's go ahead and check out which one did he uh, remove? Which one did he move to the beginning? Okay, so he moved the one. So, hmm. 
actually asked what my name was. My name is Sir Robin of Camelot. Did he remove... What? Is that... So... That was four of three. Okay, yeah, that was close. Especially when I'm trying to do this. Well, I can't do a deathless, but hey. Okay. Let's move right on into this middle game as we completely and utterly destroy the Zerg. Curious. So, um, so a few things that really make this whole thing a little more interesting um, is that, as opposed to the Devil's Playground, you're not sitting around constantly waiting for about. Uh, 30 minutes for something to be finished mining. Is this a permanent bot? That's beautiful. So, let's go ahead and... Wait a minute. I um, might need to update it. Probably need to update it. So, uh, let's see. Oh, wait a minute. Uh oh. F in the chat? Or no F in the chat, anyway. What kind of like. Those are biomes from the. Those are, um, Scourge. Mini Scourge from the, uh,. From the, uh... Oops. I think that's accidentally really good positioning. Of that particular bot. So let's go ahead and start using uh, control groups because I hear those are very helpful in all the rage nowadays. I think I need a few more pairs. Let's get a few more Dorameras. 
So, all, all, all in all, this is pretty fun, uh, playing with the, um, uh, the buyer fat, but it is dead. Nope. Where is it? Oh, there they are. They are very sturdy. So let's go ahead and make a line of stim machines. So then we just queue up like two more of those. Oh wait. <laughs> I'm enjoying the big pair of pen way too much. It's an archon. They're archoning into the mightiest pair of them all. Go ahead and place down another one of those, and another one of those. Uh, let's put this down right here. So, I think my goal here is just to get a few more durometers, get some more fire fats, and then we roll. And no one else has orders. These from uh, so where are my uh, crew wars? Did I completely miss this spot? Looks like I did. This Demica, the big pear man, is especially good. Let's go ahead and throw a bunch of those down. Let's roll. Whoa, whoa. But. Right. How dare they. Let's go ahead and start up another round of those. Some more fire fats. More Dharamers. Micro this guy around a bit, have him inspect that. Does he have an attack? Oh, come on. So, what does math a thrower do? Let's look at it. Uh, let's get some more pairs. I want big pair energy. That just is a sentence I never thought I'd ever. All right. There are these guys. Go ahead and separate out my army, see if there are any unmerged, uh... So now we use the Maffel Thrower.
Interesting. Ooh. So what does a Maffle Thrower do? It's an activatable ability, but it looks doesn't look. Too, oh, well, I know what it does. It extends the range of the. Uh, oh, this is the last of them. Let's go ahead and defeat this. This is really short. It just felt really short. Oh. No banelings. <sighs> well, as we roll right into uh, the next one, the next one's... This one was very... Uh, very straightforward. Definitely felt very fun to use both ideas. But uh, I think my favorite has got to be the Big Pair Man. The Byrefy was very fun to play with because of the, you know, it felt much better. Uh, especially conser considering the fact that it, um, you know, that just feels better for some reason. And I got four Zerg Research, which is really cool because Zerg Research is, uh, Very fun to mess with. So, as we wrap this up with a pretty smooth, uh... It's a pretty smooth game from start to end. Wrap this up with, uh... Dr. Ariel Hansen rolling right into this. Ah, uh, for some reason, this... this you know, things like that, for some reason, it just... Feels like you went way too. Uh, went. Feels like you go way too fast in these. It just feels like, bruh. I feel really like I didn't talk at all, and it just making me think. Did were there large patches of silence? It's probably a really um. Probably not needed for a major contemplation, but as we. Look at these upgrades, you know, Bire Fats gain 40, plus 40 life, deal air damage, also heals bio allied biological, yes, this one's very good, very good, Darabers get plus one range in exchange of 10 life, so what do we want, um, Chris missile turret armor by two, uh, it looks like Blades now fires a missile that can deal area damage to a flying enemies. Oh, okay. Why did the why doubles the covered area of Nareem's and Defender mode? Hmm. Very interesting. But I think I'm gonna hold off for right now. Actually, no, I'll get uh, wide lenses. The next one is going to be Bill Shear. Let's get all of this out of the way. Uh, and let's go for that. And let's roll into the next one next time. I hope you all enjoyed this. And. Uh, hug your mother, or uh, hug your parents. What was the other thing? Uh, drink some water. That's especially important. Don't ever give me a list, I'll forget everything on it, so. Uh, you know, hug your parents, drink some water, have some fun, and have a great week, guys. And I'll see you all next time with some Bell Shear action.